It's nothing we can do about that, honestly. It's like JM deserved it. He's just... What score did he shoot? Okay, I mean, we shot a bloody four under 18. round. That's our round of the week by far. We shot more under par today than we were throughout the week. It was it was four bogeys, though, that cost us. Like, four bogeys. Song JM shoots 11 under 63. All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to more EA Sports PGA Tour career mode. We missed out in the last episode by two shots. No, I think it was actually four shots Song J beat us in. Uh, but it was just heartbreaking, really, because we had a couple of huge... Uh, blow up holes and, and then Sung JM just had the most clutch 63 on the final day. He shot seven under. I actually shot my best round of the week. I think I shot a four under there in round four. Ended up coming solo second. So our last two tournaments, we've come third and we've come second. So we're trending in the right direction. We're going to play the Kiwi Championship at Tara Easy Golf Club just because I think this course is absolutely stunning. If you want me to play the main classic in the Dibin uh, Dominican Open before uh, the Open Championship, let me know. Maybe we could play one of the two i'm not sure let me know down in the comments what you think anyway let's do this thing let's jump on into the kiwi championship let's not hold off too long let's see what we got we're playing alongside patrick cantley today seamus power up the irish the irish man seamus power leads the way and we are going to jump in with four to seven mile an hour winds here at tara Edie, one of the most beautiful golf courses um in the world i feel like this is just an absolutely stunning golf course it's a relatively new golf course too and what i do need to do is turn on commentary because i had it turned off for my video yesterday that i did with uh, amanda rose so if you want to check that out as well you can do that i recorded a, a video with uh, golf analyst and and twitter content creator uh, amanda rose and we had some fun with it so check that one out it was a blast and uh thank you to her for coming on it was it was real fun we'll probably do a stream together at some point soon so wait what score was i was i over par three over come on it's a hangover from the u.s open this is a hangover from the u.s open all right the great thing about this course is you can bomb it it's similar to st andrews in that way you can drive it like near 400 yards i can go for the green here i'm pretty sure to los angeles and on to auckland new zealand your home country I can tell from you, from Los Angeles to Tara Edi is worth the time it took getting here because, Frank, this place is absolutely magnificent. I'm glad you think that way, Rich. I, All I right. just want to say, it's welcome, fine. and it's nice to be home. 54 uh, yards left. Two hours north of where I grew up as a kid. It's a really I beautiful course. A public golf course called Chamberlain Park in Auckland. And to see the game develop in this country, and, and Tara Edi wasn't even around then, to see them build a, a, a wonderful golf course. In a spectacular venue. Oh, come you know, on, Patrick. A, not this shit again. Country, they have a really realistic country. here, don't they? But look around, and, you, and you've you already said it to me. You just love the scenery. You enjoy the type of golf that's available in New Zealand. So welcome to everybody to my hometown and my home country. I love that, that he's giving us a little intro to his home country. That's dope as hell. All right. We're ready, baby. We well, are so ready. Line. I'm feeling good about Great this one. Even though we're three over through the really sim, I've players. I've shot pretty low on this course when I've played it generally. So Just if we can have that same type of form, I'm feeling good about it. Par four. Jameis Powerlad, Chilter. Are we playing the last few holes here? I can't remember what hole we started on. I think we started That's on like 12. I, I doubt we're playing all the way till the end. Oh, we are. Uh, we're playing five holes. Yeah we're, yeah, we're playing the last five holes. Okay. I thought we were on 12 or so. We're actually on 14. Oh, should have played the blast there. No, ah, it's actually pretty damn good, you know. I thought that was going to stop a lot quicker. That was perfect. That I was guess it's firm as hell. Nicely done indeed. Oh, Patrick, no. Just gonna sneak on by. Patrick, Patrick, Patrick Cantley. All right, it's above. You can clearly see that. So we want to be going just out there. Is it uphill? It's slightly uphill, so let's just give it a welly and uh, make a birdie. Beautiful. Beautiful birdie to get it back to two over now. Two under on the back nine so far. We got four holes left. Let's try and get it back to level par by the end of this round. That'll be a really good start here at uh, Atara ET. We'd be level par for the round and we'd be in contention. Even with that horrible start. Cantley's two under. Famous power leads the way. I'm feeling someone's going to go like six, seven under on this course though. Tough one here. That pin especially. Like, look at that pin. That's a joke. That pin's a joke for a 200 yard shot. I'm hoping it's not downwind. Thank God. It's into the wind. That makes this hole actually a lot easier, I think. I'm going to play a little bit of a high fade here and try and get this to stop up quickly because this is a really difficult, uh, difficult one. Too far. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Wowee. Sit. 
Okay, honestly, not terrible. Not terrible. Okay, By the way, if you want 20% you off Rogue Energy, energy guys, use my Maybe code, the Apex Hound. Enough. You'll get 20% off. I'm wearing the Rogue Top as well. You get 20% off and... Uh, and it's just after restocking as well. So give it a shot. See what you think, baby. See what you think. Get Strawberry Kiwi for the love of God. It's such a good flavor. That's a little bit long, but good shot from Cantley. And we built up Birdie Putts here Safe on a tough part three. So we'll take it. And if you're interested in story this. games, I'm doing a Dragon Age uh, Dragon Age Inquisition playthrough over on the Apex Sound 2. Check it out. I've been really enjoying it. Just recorded part three. That should be up by now as well. And I recorded an Alone in the Dark video. The little prologue that they did. Get in. Could it be back to back birdies? Oh no! That's a cruel, cruel twist of fate there. I thought we had it, man. Oh, that's tough. Come on, man. Okay. Good putt, Cantley. Good putt, Cantley. You know what I'm thinking it could actually be a good one is the lighthouse point could be a good one for us because the greens are generally pretty flat. Playing that one on sim will be easier than playing most courses on sim. Which, uh, okay, which would be nice. See if we get a, a win, get some momentum running, heading into the uh, the Open Championship. Is. St. Andrews I like a lot, dude. I really do like St. Andrews a lot. Tell me the win's with us, Patrick. It's playing 375. I really do think if the win is with us, we can get there, though. With the power drive. That's how much this course runs. But it's not on tournament conditions is the only thing, so we'll right see. Side. Boy, a good round going here on good this shot. Thursday, and that another. Yeah, wind's not with us. I'm just still gonna hit a power drive and get it up there as close as possible, and then we can hit a little spinner close. Again, just a little bit out to the right with the driver. That's twice now in a row we've done that. Just yeah, see what I mean? If this was downwind, I think we would have got it there. I think we would have got it there. Hit the middle of the good shot from there. As he sets for a second into the wind. I'm not sure about an extra club or more. Only five mile an hour wind. But that's a good shot from Cantley. Overspun it a little bit, but decent uphill look there at Birdie. I want to be anywhere inside uh, Patrick shot. there. Pause. Safely Come on, on man. I'm always underswinging these spinners, man. Not bad. We are inside of Patrick Cantley, can confirm. Cantley birdies again, back to back birdies for Patrick Cantley. He gets the four under and takes the solo lead, I think. And we gotta match him here. Alright, come on, baby. It's all we got. All night long, this is what we do. Oh, good read. Just needed a tiny bit less. Tiny bit less break. Alright, another par. We need to finish strong here. We do have a par 5 that's very reachable, the last hole. So maybe an eagle is on the carrots there, but we'll see. It's a birdie hole. Let's see what Patrick does. Patrick can play. Going just left of it, and that should spin back a little bit, I'd imagine. No, good shot by Patrick. He leaves himself 13 foot for birdie, and he's uh, he's starting to turn it up now. He's starting to heat up here as Patrick can play. I'm thinking the 143 here could be perfect. I mean that. I, I do think this could be actually, actually absolutely perfect. Maybe too much, even. Let me come back to 138. I didn't underswing, underswing that by 2.5%. Okay, Might have been left okay. There's still a little left, though, so we're going to give Patrick Cantley a read here is That's the only problem as well. The third okay, so it's uphill, breaking left to right, and then at the end, I feel like it's the opposite. It's downhill breaking right to left. So this is confusing, to say the least. But I'm going to go with this. I think it breaks more left to right. Oh, good read. Good effort. Ooh, good, good effort. It's going to be a tap-in par. We'll take that. We'll take that, baby. Come on. All right. Antley for three straight birdies to get to five under par. And he nails it. Patrick Cantley oh, yes. is on fire now. He's on fire. And he's leading the tournament alone. No we are seven shots back in the lead all of a sudden. Man, I've played my holes one under, so uh, a little bit harsh. Antley leads alone. Seamus Powers at four under. As I said, I do think someone will get to six, seven under. I didn't think it would be my playing partner, though. So this is a very reachable par five to finish, especially with the way the ball rolls on this course. It's going to be uh, it's going to be a green light special to give yourself an eagle chance here. So an eagle would get us uh, would get us back to level par, which is what I wanted all along. And would get us back in the mix for round two. 
that's what I'm looking for. A little layup from Cantley though. He hits a, a three wood. Another good tee shot right it's a narrow fairway is the only thing, so you do kind of have to be a little bit cautious. But even if you don't hit the fairway, I still think it's very reachable. What if I aim at that, the top of that shed there? The grandstand? Okay. Yeah, I think maybe just a little bit. Like there. God damn it, I pushed it. Every power drive I've hit so far, I've pushed way right. Which is very frustrating. It's gonna be dog shit, man. Come on, get lucky, get lucky. Come down, come down. Please, please. Oh, for fuck's and sakes. That one, oh my god, I just need to stop to hitting the power on. drive, man. I could have still easily got on too if I just did the normal drive. The power drive has just not worked for me today. Just every power drive I've hit has gone bleh, dead right. Apparently with a layup. Bitch. We're gonna have to lay up too, though. I think. I think I am gonna have to lay up, that unless it like moves my ball somehow. Shot, it did move my ball. I don't know why. Here as he readies his second. I guess it couldn't have me standing on the slope or something. Is this isn't gonna hit the bunker here, is it? It did. Fucking did. It goddamn very well did. That's disappointing. All right, hit the lip, but. Uh, Stop. Stop! Oh my god. What a shock and finish this Impressive. is turning out to be. We might get not even get a birdie here. Second. We'll see. Alright, that's doable. disappointing, boys. It really is. We still got it up there fairly far, to be fair. We got it close to the green. Still get up and down for a birdie. God, that was bad. That was atrociously bad, but we've given ourselves 12 foot for birdie. All right, not exactly Just played this hole really sport. terrible. If we walk out of this hole with the birdie, with birdie, that would be pretty magical, all things considered, honestly, because we've just not deserved it, really. Can't leave for birdie. Bonus if it goes in, you just need to make sure you get it there and give yourself a chance. For then four straight to finish the round, he's giving it a chance. He's giving it a chance. It goes in. Yeah. Oh my oh, god! I thought we'd actually got away with there. Can't leave. Finish a six under for and round that. one. Incredibly. Why am I seeing like different little weird pat patterns on the green? You guys seeing that? It's weird, right? I think mean, that's a glitch. Good putt. Good putt to finish. Brilliant birdie to finish. Got away with one big time and we finished one over. Honestly, considering the sim, not terrible. We are just inside the cut line as it stands, so we're going to need a good round too. And we're going to need some help from the sim here if we want to make the cut. All right. Come on, boys. Let's go ahead and do it. Can't have a missed cut. We still have a, have our streak of made every single cut. Have not missed a cut yet. So let's go ahead and make the cut here. Sim, don't do me dirty. Current score plus one. What hole am I starting on? Current hole seventh. Okay, so I'm level par. Projected cut line's even par. Okay. We're gonna need to play our hearts out here, boys. We're gonna need to play our little hearts out. We can't have a missed cut. That's just unacceptable. On the PGA Tour. I can't believe it. Proudly present the season long race. I can't even believe it, son. Cup. All right, all pars so far, but they've given us a drivable hole here. For a heck of a battle these next three days. And tree, tree wood, brother. Leaderboard here on this Friday. All right, watch the shot. It's gonna be a genius three wood. At six under par. Gonna Let's be a genius three way. As we pick things up at the par four seven. Please, I'm begging. Hit the upslope. Hit the upslope. Kill it. Fuck. No issues here. That is into the fairway. All right, just a little too much, but it's not gonna be too bad from over there. A little spinner maybe and make a birdie. Who are we playing with? I didn't even see. Was it Sung J M? Sung J after after winning the U S Open. You couldn't have played like this at the goddamn U S Open, Sung J. My arch nemesis. Sung J M is my arch nemesis. Whatever. I want the world to know. Sungjae, I'm coming for you with everything I've got. Good shot. Gotta respect that, though. <laughs> That's this just a great shot, Sungjae. It's still gonna go through like mine, though. Incredible. Right Alright, guys, I need to make some birdies early doors here and try and ensure that we're gonna make this cut. I don't wanna, I don't wanna even be flirting with it. I don't want the sim to even give it, give them a shot, you know? Great shot there. Should be good enough for a birdie there. Good one. Four foot four inches for a for a birdie to get back to level par and inside the cut line as it stands. As he lines up his second from the fairway. Im goes a little bit further right than me, but still half decent. Five foot seven inches. This is to get back inside the cut line as well. Me and Sungjae both battling hard to make the cut here. Ah yes, runs that one right in. It's a birdie here at the seventh. 
And he's going to need to keep See what I mean when I go down low on this course? Like, what is what the hell are these things? One shot of the cut line is that something that actually happens in Tara Edie, or is that just a glitch? I think it's a glitch. I've never seen that before, though. All right. Uh, well done. Birdie. Good birdie, birdie indeed. 287 to carry that bunker over there. Can't really see. Okay. All right. I'm just going to go with the normal driver. I pushed it again, man. God, I'm There's pushing everything. It's going to be over, though. Thank God. I thought that was going to be in that bunker. It's actually over. It's perfect now. It's absolutely splendid now. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, sir. 80 yards out. The fuck's taking this man so long? That's up the left side. No problems there. That's going to wind up... Sung Jim took about way. nine years to decide on that one. But a good shot nonetheless, I guess. And it's coming backwards. No, Sung Jae. going to skip that. All right, Sungjae, what you got for us? Show us second how it's done, because I'm putting this one real close. Time. I want to see what you do first, Notably though. The third. Sung the the yards to the hole. Little hole left. Right in the Little left. Sit, 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 sit. Good shot. Good shot, Sungjae. 14 foot bad. for good birdie. Shot. But it's Inside not good enough to match imagine. me, all right? So that's, what I'm, that's what I'm really saying here. How about birdie. a little pitch here? What am I thinking? What are we thinking with a little pitch here? 75 yard pitch, because the Bob is running. In these conditions, it's running, so I'm going to go for this. Fuck it. YOLO. Not even close. Wow, it's going to kick. Fucking moron. You useless, utter moron. Shut up. All right, I think a little spinner here. I'm going to spin this into the hole. Watch this. Yeah, it's good. It's a par, though. It's a boring old par. It's actually five foot away. That looked like two foot max. All right, so we have a we have a little bit of a struggle for power there. This one measures out to 15 Whoa. feet. Sung J. Oh, mm, boy, that's a good stroke. All right, again, that. look at this. It's so strange. I've only seen that on this course, using that camera. Nowhere else. Must be something to do with Tara Edie's greens. The fuck! It was set above. No. It's set away. above, man. Right there. Yeah, and it says above here. Why did that not turn in? Even at the hole, it says it's above from the other side. It's above from this side. Wait, what? Okay, at the hole it turns. Ah, at the hole it turns the other way. Okay, I'm off. stupid. All right, I didn't even. I didn't really take He's that putt into account. It was so now. short. I just assumed that it was above at my feet. It meant it meant it would be. Above the whole way, pretty much. I don't know. I didn't even really think about that putt that much. Stupid okay, though. Bogey, and we're back outside the, the cut line now. And he'll stay at I'm scared. Over. How many holes do we have left to get back inside? We're outside the cut line, boys. This is scary. Cut line's even. Two. Oh, God. We only have two holes. Okay. Well, that's not good. We have the ninth and the tenth. We need a birdie in both. We need a birdie in both. I think you give myself a chance, considering how harsh the sim has been on me. I do not want to miss cut here. Sung J M, he's a bim. Sung J M, la bim ba dim ba da u da da di. You like my song, guys? Good shot, Sung J. Wait, I lied. That was a bit shot, idiot. All right, little high fade here. Get it moving in from that spad. Got away with it, I think. Maybe not. Oh my! That's unfortunate. And 109 that's yards the whole way from the bunker. There won't be too bad. And, we go to and boy, Iowa do we speed. need to! Tiger's blood and rainbow candy mixed together. To to Top tier. Of this green, but it's 138 yards. You'll need to get all the way to the hole. Pin smack bang in the middle. 20 foot for Sungjae. It's a solid shot. I want to be half that or less. Regulation, but a little away from the band. Half that or less. You understand me, you little bitches, you little weasels. That's not enough club, idiot. All right, watch this. It's going to be a genius shot. This is going to be what you call a great shot. Where I come from. I actually don't get a good lie with the finesse in the in the bunker here, so I'm going to hit this full. Underswing? Are you shitting me? Spin, left. 
Oh, what a shot. Come on, what a shot. Thank God it was under swing. It's perfect. Now oh, it's six foot three inches for birdie. Come on, baby. Let's go. Strike. Bang. Bang, bang. Dong J. Sung J M. It's a cool twist of feet. Pretty much nothing in this, I think. Slightly uphill, pretty much nothing in it. I'm just gonna go with it. Wow, it turned right to left hard. Hard right to left too. I didn't see that at all. Alright, well, I didn't see that at all. So I'm I'm struggling now. I feel like I've I've gotten the grips with the with the green rating in this video I've just been dick. I feel like I kind of got a, got to grips with it, but now I have read those last two really poorly now. Really, really poorly. Is U.S. Okay, Open? I thought we put it quite well. Four. We were solo second, you know, we were playing well. But I think we're uh, gonna miss the cut here, guys. We need to birdie this. We need to somehow birdie the 223 yard par three with elevation changes and a sloped green. This looks really difficult. There's a little bit of a backstop though. Which Sungjae is going to go right on through. It'll be a nightmare from there, Sungjae. We do not want to be up there because that means it's curtains, and honestly. Especially if we bogey this one, we are done so. All right, six irons the club. Come on, six irons the club. A little high draw. Come on, here we go. Oh, I overswung it though. Kick, 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 kick! Fuck you! I think this may be our first cut, my friends. First miscut. Miscut, that is. Calm down, everyone. <laughs> Calm down. Ooh, Nelly. Told you that was going to be difficult. Jesus. I was going all the way off the green here for a second. All right, if we want any hope, we need to get this up and down and then hope that the sim gets us under par for the remaining holes, but... That's wonderful. Stop, then, you know? And spinner my ass. That was a runner if I've ever seen one. All right, we have ten foot left to save our season, really. Not our season. <laughs> save our uh, our tournament, rather. Sungjae makes his. That looks straight in, though. So I'm hoping mine is similar. I'm hoping mine is similar. Come on, let's read this correctly now. Oh, clearly breaks right to left. I feel like at the hole. Right. I feel like right there breaks right to left. Right at the end. Let's hope I'm right. Let's hope I'm right, because if I'm not, we're in trouble. I was right, but I overhit it. Nope. I hit I hit a 2.1% overswing. I think I gave it a little too much as well. And that's going to be a bogey. That's going to be two over. And I think that could be our first missed cut of the season, my friends. Unfortunately, that's the way it is. Okay, that one in for a bogey here at 10. No! Two birdies? I made the cut, did I? I think I made the cut. Holy shit, that's so lucky. <laughs> the sim gave us a... Gave us some glory right there at the end. So for we made the cut. Yeah, we're inside the top 50. Hell yeah. Let's do this. Let's make a move on moving day here. I'm going to make a killer move here on moving day. Watch this. I've got this course in the bag now. All right. Moving day with my good old Hawaiian shirt here. This is my moment. All right, my friends. Let's do this thing. We pick things up on the tee at the par 412. Par 412. Tough hole. Par here wouldn't be the worst. But we need to be birdie in every hole if we want some. Wow, that went dead left. Jesus, okay. Luckily, there's a big wide fairway there because that is. That's still go. Hello? Hey, that was some St. Andrews. This is good prep for St. Andrews, honestly. This is good prep for St. Andrews. <laughs> oh my goodness, man. I feel like for quick rounds as well, I should probably have like the grids on maybe. Green grids on for quick tournaments and then for the majors leave it off. Because the majors is meant to be like more of a challenge, right? So let's try with the green grid on for now. Well you can't walk out and um, drop it and I, I just mean that. the the grid, not the beads. Shot right there. Let's see if that makes some sort of difference for us. I don't know how much of a difference that'll make, honestly. I don't think it'll make that much of a difference. Really, but you never know. It might just give us a little bit of a Notice kind of a visual cushion right at least. We'll see. As he eyes his second. The majors, I'm gonna have it off anyway though. I feel like U.S. Open was such a good, such a good contest there. Patrick Cantley lays up back uh, and hits a genius shot there. Wow. Wow, what a shot from Cantley. 
All right, Patrick. I see you, buddy. I see you. All right. Anywhere inside that, I'm good. To get this on somehow, his second from the fairway bunker. Sit. 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 What a shot! What a shot! What a shot! Come on. Left ourselves nine foot for birdie. Oh, Beauty. Actually, kind of spun back a little bit. If it had one hop stop, it might have been feet. better. All right, so you can see quite clearly above here and uphill. Come on, let's go. Good birdie. Come on, back to back birdies. We're two under. I didn't even check our sim, actually. Are we playing five holes, four holes? What are we playing? Four holes left after this one, okay. All right, three holes left after this one, rather. We're playing 12 through 15. Okay. Yes. Patrick hey, Cantley birdies as well. He's six under par. He's pretty much up there, isn't he? What were we two under? We're two no under. Okay. You know what? We're not out of this yet. If we have a really good couple of holes here, and then the sim helps us out for round four, you just never know in this thing, man. This is drivable hole too. Come on, eagle. I clearly don't want to hit power drive though. I mean, that's just way too much. All right, let's hit a little high one. We want this to stop up if we can. This is a difficult one though, because it's. All around that green, there's so much like craziness going on. Good looking shot though. Oh, this looks really good. Oh my god, what a shot. Oh, what a shot. Stop. Come back down this hill. Come back down this hill a little bit. Don't you stay up there. Come on. Come. Mm. Great shot though. I mean, that is eagle putt. We make that for eagle. That'll be my best hole in a very long time, I think. All right, Patrick, you're going a little right of it. A little layup. A little up to the right-hand side. I love this hole, though. It's, it's so fun, because like, it's so tough to stop it on the green with a driver, but if you do, it feels really good, just like we did there. You know, that feels brilliant right there. All right, Cantley lays up with the three-wood. He's playing it the opposite way, but I feel like might as well go for it, because this is still a similar shot you'd get if you missed it with the driver, you know? It's a tough one. Ooh, is that going to get down? Oh, what a shot. That was pretty magical by Cantley, not gonna lie. That was that was a beautiful shot. Just enough pace. Played it perfectly. Perfectly. So here we go. Alright, quite clearly a lot of break here. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of break in the middle of this thing. Even more than that, is there? No, less. Okay. Good shot. Good putt. It was a tough one to read, honestly. It was a tough one to read, so. We'll take that. Six foot four inches past. For a birdie, still not a gimme for the birdie, honestly. It went a little bit further by than I thought, even. Antley with a beautiful birdie. Fair play. Uh, All right, hopefully we're going to show Patrick birdies, that there's two different ways to play this with birdies. Five. This we'll is above, really? It says above, but I don't see that, personally. I'm going to go straight at it. But I think it turns back the opposite way. Oh, I was right. I was yeah, right. Wow. I ignored the, the advice of the, into that position, of the reader, and I was, uh, I was stupid for that. I, I thought for sure, like, it turned back right at the end, though. Or turn back... Yeah, because when okay, I was putting so down, it was all right to left. That's what confused me. That's what threw me off there a little bit. So I thought at the hole, from where we were, it would be it would be left to right. That's frustrating. That's frustrating. We drove the green and, and three-putted from 30 foot. You know, that's just not ideal, man. I blame the grids being on. And Cantley, again, like, immediately when I start playing with him, birdies three in a row. Like, that's what's happened now multiple times. It's weird. Let's hope he doesn't make it four in a row again. It's just the holes he's playing with me. He's birdieing every single every single one, man. This is not right, Patrick. This is so not this, right. Another fine tee shot. All right, I'm gonna power drive this bad boy. I just hit that as hard as I possibly could. Oh my god, what a bomb! <laughs> Let's go. Oh my god, that's an absolute giga bomb right there. Holy moly, we got about 30 yards left. <laughs> what a shot. He wanted that on. Alright, come on, birdie here. Get us the three under, four back. Five back, I think we would be actually, because Scott Stallings was eight under, I think. But Patrick Cantley's about to be eight under as well, anyway, because it's just ridiculous at this point. Every time I'm playing with these goddamn AI, Rich, there's one thing it's insane. All right, gotta put this close, come on. The spinners have been running crazy, so I'm gonna put this quite a bit short. 
You know what I mean? Like these spinners are just running. The, stern, the spinners just straight up aren't fucking working, man. Oh my god, this is a nightmare. All right, let's go with this. You fucking clown! I didn't hit it. I underswung it. If I didn't underswing that, that's right in the middle of the hole as well. I read it perfectly. I just underswung the club like a moron. Oh my god, this tournament's been frustrating for us so far. It's been frustrating for us so far, I must say. Just haven't had my best stuff, man. It's a birdie at 14. Can't play with four straight birdies there. Definitely not say no to that. Oh, shut up. Is this the last hole? No, there's one more after this. All right. Two under. It's about how I've played, to be fair. I haven't played great. The sim screwed us on the first day, but it's helped us since, so it's kind of balanced out. We just haven't played great stuff overall. We really haven't. It's a stunning course, though. I wish I could have played better stuff here. And Cantley, gonna make another birdie. Five straight. Why not? Maybe a hole in one. I mean, it's a fucking. This is a joke now at this point. Like, what's going on? I'm going. I'm going eight iron. I know that seems crazy, but I think I think this could work. Ah, oh, fuck off, man! Come on, I'm dog shit right now. I am dog shit right now, man. Shame. I'm getting frustrated, lads. I'm getting frustrated. New foot for par. We'll get a read off Patrick just in case we can't make this putt, you know? And with that beautiful use of the flop shot, it's a good chance really to get Antley up and to down. get to nine under. Woohoo. Five straight birdies. Well done, Patrick. It's always immediately when he starts playing with me as well. All right, par. And we're going to finish the round at two under. Part our, part our way home. All right, someone was 13 so under there. Shane Lowry, go on. Go on, Shane. Fair play to you. All right, we need a good final round and get ourselves up towards the top of the leaderboard. Obviously, we're not going to win this thing, but, you know, up up there at least. Get ourselves into the top 10, maybe, if we have an insane final round. You never know. We would need help from the sim there as well, though. All right, let's try and finish strong. Let's finish strong here with Xander Shoffley. Shane Lowry leads the way. I didn't check what score we were. We're playing with Xander, though. All right, I'm three under, I think I saw. So we're one under uh, with four to play. Not been our best stuff this week, but you never know. Maybe a hold of one here would uh, solid rounds together, trying change to our spirits. Mother Nature and this course and trying to beat the entire field as we check the leaderboard. Shane Lowry is exact on same shot as I hit the last time, except much better. Let's head out to the course. And Come on, go, up. go. The Wonderful shot there. Wonderful shot there. All right, you take 13 foot for birdie. Long. Well done, on son. Green. Xander, give us something similar, buddy. All right, X man, X gonna give it to you. X gonna give it to you. It's a good shot too. That's a decent shot as well, good sir. We turn to Notabege the third for this look at birdie. Notabege the third, huh? Spot just below the hole. I don't see any movement at all. All right, pretty dead straight, honestly. Oh, Seemed yes. like a relatively straightforward putt. Why does the AI always immediately when they start playing with me just make birdie? Like, is that like a, a, a thing, like a glitch or some shit? I don't know. Yeah, this seems dead straight, week. though. I'm just going to go ahead and barrel it in there. I think there's slight right to left, if anything. It was more than slight. I could read that, but I just fucking there, saw his go dead straight in, and I honestly was like, I'm just going to do the same thing, not give away the hole. How about you fucking stick with your gut, idiot? All right, shame. I don't think the grids have helped us much, to be honest. I feel like uh, it's been more of a distraction than anything. Okay, we just haven't played well. We haven't played well enough. No excuses, really. Haven't played well enough. All right, I think we can get it there. The wind's with us. But if not, probably not. Yeah, that's a nice swing, and the result is going to be a tee shot that is set up just fine. Wind's pretty dead, so I'm just going to hit power drive anyway. It's a wide fairway. If we get it to the front of the green, fair enough. Nope. Oh, it's the typical push with the power drive. Why not? Good shot, though. From there, I think I'm going to flop it straight up and over. Put it close. Make a birdie. Come on. No more bullshit, guys. I want to be informed coming into the Open Championship. We're so frustrated the after the U.S. Open. I really am frustrated seconds. after the U.S. Open. I feel like that was just not at all what we wanted. 
You know, it was just the, the final round. It was just Sungjae, man. I wanted to win that so badly. And Sungjae ruined it for us. But, you know what? It's all good. Uh, it's I'm really feeling good about the open. I'm feeling good about our chances in the open. I really am. Now, far from the best shot I've seen today. I'm gonna need to hit a long flop here. And we know how big the dispersion zone is on the long flop, but I'm gonna go for it. I hope we get lucky with that dispersion zone. We did not. Fucking hell, we did not. Waving at the, hole as it the dispersion whizzed. zone with the long flop's honestly a complete and utter joke. Like, Just what in the world was that? This one closed. Down the Again, with this weird ass shit happening. Right, it says it's level, but I, I think it does break a little bit from left to right. We'll see. Now turn. Now turn! Hmm. Didn't turn that much. Oh, what a frustrating day, man. What a frustrating day here. Able to control the speed. It's uphill. Not much break in it. Maybe just a touch to the left. All right, that breaks quite clearly right to left there. Down your pars. Just didn't break quite that much, but... Right, let's go with this. Oh, come on! all the way. Give me a break, man! Fucking idiot. Okay, uh, in for a bogey at six. Oh my god, man. Like, that looked in the whole way. I played at one point. It was 1.2 degrees above or some shit. It doesn't turn in that little extra bit. I thought I was going to be giving okay, it too little, if anything. I don't know, man. X-Man, go and give it to you. X, go and give it to you. I mean, we have been playing well. Let's be fair. We got we got third and second in the tournaments before this. It was always going to be hard to keep that up the whole goddamn rest of the season, you know? Um, I'm not complaining about our form, form overall. I think it's been really good. We just kind of lacked the, the killer instinct towards the end of these tournaments. Sit. 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 Good shot. Very good okay. shot. Six foot six inches. For birdie. Downhill then uphill. It's 1.3 degrees above. I'm gonna go with this. Why do I keep overreading them now? I couldn't bloody overread the putts of my life. I'm overreading all the short ones, that man. Like fuck me. Here for birdie. God Almighty. Overreading every single short putt now. Moronic oh, idiot. That's in for birdie Even when I had the grids on, when I was playing yesterday, I was overreading every short putt, no. missing every short putt. Like it's not even to do with the green grids. Like yesterday I, uh, against Amanda, I was I was fucking had the green grids on. I was still missing all of my short putts, just overreading them and, and hitting them too hard and just like not using the correct line for short putts. Like I need to got my head screwed on correctly. Let's finish with an eagle here, so I don't really lose my head. All right, Xander Shuffler. Well, since when the fuck is he seven under? Wait, what? Beautiful I thought Xander was like way back. No, in the fairway. I don't even. I don't even know. He has made a couple of birdies, yeah, but I didn't even think he was. He was in contention at all. Good drive there, at least. Good drive on the final hole. Right down the middle, and we should have a chance to go on in two. Let's make an eagle to finish. I said I want an eagle to finish. Let's do it. Come on. It's been a bitterly disappointing, uh, bitterly disappointing week here at Tari in New Zealand. We're a little bit jet lagged. We're playing. Uh, we're playing in New Zealand one week after we just played the U.S. Open. I should have taken this week off. I told you guys. You guys forced me to play this. Should have taken the week off. I should have taken the week week off. And now we're going back to Maine to play the. The bloody next you tournament, you know? I have jet lag. I'll show you how it's done. Right, I'm going to show you how it's done. Oh, in the hole for an albatross. Great shot. The great shot. We're giving ourselves a good eagle chance there. Wonderful shot. 20 foot for eagle. Come on, let's finish with an eagle now. No bullocks. No bullocks, sir. I'd love to finish with an eagle. Oh, he's playing the creative shot by going up and down and around. It's not going to work out too well, though. So, uh, Xander Schauffele. Right, exactly I think it was Sung Jim I was thinking of that wasn't playing well. I didn't have a good score, at least. Play. 
uh, distracting with all the shit on the green as well. It makes it more difficult to read for sure. Good, good effort. Top in birdie to finish. Mm, over it again, but that was a good read for Instead, from outside of for six foot. I'm not too displeased if we overread, but I'd rather miss it on the high side. But the short ones, I need to stop doing it. I need to goddamn stop doing it. Sander yeah! finishes eight under. Fair play. Good week for you, pal. It's a birdie on the last for both of us. Just a little bit of a disappointing week overall, but three under is not the worst. It's not the worst. It just was, it should have been so much better. We're still just inside the top 30, you know, and we made the cut on the number. We got lucky to make the cut, honestly. We got lucky to make the cut, and we finished three under for the weekend. So the weekend wasn't too bad. It was just, it's just a little frustrating, man, because I feel like we could have got much lower. Shane Lowry wins. Go on, Shane Lowry. He wins every single person near the top shot of 66 there. That's hilarious. The top five guys all, all shot 66. No worries, guys. No worries at all. Don't. Don't you worry. Don't you fret about that one. That is a frustrating one, but I am not worried about it. We're going to we're going to Maine and we're going to win the Maine Classic. I'm calling it right now. Next video, we're winning this tournament at the at, at the Lighthouse Point. The cliffs at Lighthouse Point, I should say. We're winning that. I, I can feel it, actually. I can feel it in my body, in my bones, that we're going to make that. We're going to win that, rather. Not make that, but... Yeah, another disappointing performance there, but, like, overall, we've been playing really good stuff recently, so... Uh, New Jersey Challenge, we we finished way back in the lead, but T21, T17, uh, T41, T53, that, that was kind of my worst run of form, but then we uh, we got back to form here with the Alberta Open and the US Open, of course. Uh, we came third and second with Sung J M winning both tournaments, actually, which is kind of frustrating. And Lowry wins that one. We finished 15 shots back in the lead, but we got 30, 31 points for it. And where are we in the FedEx Cup? Let's have a look. We're sixth in the FedEx Cup. Lowry jumps into the top 10, jumps into seventh place. Uh, Sung JM somehow still isn't at the top of that. Cameron Young is at the top of the FedEx Cup rankings. Xander Schauffele in third. Scotty Scheffler in second. Tony Finau's up there as well. So fun, uh, fun times, guys. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. Make sure to drop a like. It's the best way to let me know you enjoyed the content. And we will be back with more EA Sports PJ Tour career mode in the next one. We'll be back for... Uh, the main classic in the next video. See you then. It's been my pleasure to serve you all. Make sure to drop a like. See you next time. Break.